All right, Norm and I are back out here protecting the hog feeders. Last time we came out here, it was covered up in birds, but there was a couple trees in our way. So we trimmed those back and now we have a much better view. We're gonna be taking some nice shots. Everything you're about to see is at 95 to 105 yards. So really nice and consistent. And we've got a decent breeze going, so should be fun shooting, not just a slaughter fest. Yeah, I'm on it. Hold eight and go. Oh, you're going. oh, you're just oh I still one see one. Ready? Yep. Oh, he got blistered so hard. I don't know when you were shooting. Well, I just saw one land back down. I see it. <laughs> nice, nice. I see one on the post all the way down there. A female I'm going to go after. You see him on the top of the fence? Nope, but go ahead. I just blistered one. Yeah, I heard it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh. It's going up. Yeah, got it. Done. Smoked. All right. Oh, oh my geez. goodness, did he try and get out of the way of that one? He did. Not fair. This one turns just as the slug gets there, and it doesn't catch her quite perfectly square, but the slug does its job, and she's down in a few feet. <laughs> Blistered. Hardcore. Nice shot. Another one coming in, but to the left. Right. Yep. Go ahead, I'm on him. Blistered. Blistered. <laughs> oh, it took his head right off. He's just flopping. Nice shot, buddy. Thanks, man. Both females. Now the wind is, what, in our face? Yeah, a little bit. All right, I'm going to take the one on the right. Okay. It was Ooh. just to the right. Were you? I feel a little more like myself. I'm Keith, not take, such a diva. <laughs> Keith taking a little snicker break in, in between shots here. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm going the one on the fence. Fun, but uh, it's making it pretty interesting too. It's coming from the left to the tune of 4 MOA for a slug and 8 MOA for our pellets, and then the very next second it'll be right from behind us and then come from the other way. So, what do you think, Norm? Is it uh, difficult or easy? Well, it's real difficult, <laughs> uh, especially shooting the pellets. You're having a lot better luck with the slugs. I have to give double the amount of wind with the pellets as you do with the slugs. Yeah, that's true. It's not just because of my innate awesomeness. Well, no, actually, no. <laughs> <laughs> I would stop. Oh, oh I matrixed me, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like all puffed up. Ready for love. Call me old baby. Today. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So as awesome as the shoot has been, uh, we've decided that we're gonna go look for some woodchucks, and hopefully get some of that on footage for you. See what happens. For that white stone right there. Yeah, I'd say that's pretty close. Blister them north. Ready? I'm on it. Oh, well nice. Good shot, man. Thanks. Oh, oh Matrix me. Yep. Yeah. Nice. Not that time. <laughs> <laughs> so, as you might have been able to tell, um, we couldn't find any woodchucks quickly, so we went right back to last 20 birds. 
I'm on it. Plus it, buddy. Oh, nice. Oh, you're going to have to go get that one. He's going to scare all the other ones away. <laughs> pair of females right there. That smacked her pretty hard. <laughs> All right, we got a woodchuck out there at 182 yards. Just off the edge of him. You on him, buddy? Now that wind feels like it's in my face almost. Hang on. All right, here we go. Oh, right over him. Right over him. Oh, brutal. Yeah, he went to that second hole. <laughs> oh, he's dead. He is so dead. We hope you enjoyed the video. We sure enjoyed making it. Can't wait to bring next week's installment to you. Stay tuned. Subscribe if you want to get notified right away.